The Milwaukee Marathon has had its share of trouble since it launched in 2015. The latest being a snowstorm the day before the big race, which was supposed to be today. Spencer Tracy tonight introduces us to two runners who just aren't giving up just yet. This is from 2016. Every race, every year, Paul Bratz gets a new medal. This one here, the last one I brought with me. Bratz was hoping to add one more medal to his collection the 2023 Milwaukee Marathon. This would have been my 18th half marathon. <laughs> the marathon had given just 49 days notice that the race was even going to happen, but Mother Nature had other plans. I looked at my phone, oh no, the race just got canceled. Organizers made the call on Saturday morning to cancel the half marathon and 5K run. It was set to start and finish at Pfizer Forum. The course took runners through downtown and over to Lake Michigan. However, the snow and ice made that impossible. I was disappointed just like everybody else, but I had been looking at the temperatures for the last week. Ken Kihus was one of the 1,000 runners signed up. He has been running the Milwaukee Marathon since it was introduced in 2015. I want to be part of the first year, second year. I want to be part of all the years so I can be a legacy runner. This race has a complicated history. Organizers say in 2016 and 17, the race wasn't measured correctly by course markers. They came back in 2019, then COVID hit, and the race hasn't gone on since. But this year's cancellation is not stopping these two runners. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. I'll be here. Hoping for one more. Yes, we are. If there's a will, there's a way. Organizers say they plan to bring the marathon back in 2024. In Milwaukee, Spencer Tracy, Fox 6 News. Organizers say in the next week they will explore all possibilities for 2023 or 2024 with city leaders. All runners will have the option to run virtually, defer to another event or get a full refund.